Hey guys, it's me Monster Map 345 here and today I am going to be doing a re-review but it actually has a kind of good reason because right now in the United Kingdom from the, well it's been from, from a couple of days but today's the 1st of March um, so from about, from about February some new monsters from America are being released over in the um, over in the UK so Ultra Fiesta is coming out which was the mango flavored sugar free drink that oh my goodness people are going to go absolutely gaga for um there's um <clears throat> I think there's chaos just or something like that which I've never tried before that I haven't seen just yet that I'm really excited for but also coming out is the I kind of surprised to be honest with you guys <clears throat> out in the UK officially from about a week ago is Monster Mule. Now, Monster Mule, it's based on ginger, on a uh, on an alcoholic drink called a Moscow Mule, which involves ginger and a couple of other different alcohols. And um, it's basically Monster's version of ginger beer. And if you guys can remember from the last time whenever I reviewed it, the American version that I got from America specifically for my review, I absolutely hated it. I ended up giving the other one to my brother. Um, I just didn't like it at all. So I'm super excited to see if the UK version tastes any different. Um, see, I've got it nice and chilled as well. Now I've done everything I can for me to really, really enjoy this. Um, it's got a new description here, so we'll get into it here. So lovely copper can. The can looks absolutely glorious. And oh my goodness, it really stands out in the fridge. Um, <clears throat> but um, yeah, so Mon Monster Mule, ginger brew, and it actually specifies here that it is non-alcoholic. Um, Monster Mule, like I say, completely different description to the last one, um, which was, um, you know, out, out, in, out in America. So we'll, we'll give this a read here. Three people walk into a Hollywood bar, a Russian vodka distributor, a copper mug salesperson and a ginger brew, ginger beer home brewer. Urban legend has it that Moscow Mule was invented. They grabbed an instant camera and took their idea to other bars, snapping pics of the novel cocktail to share with the next barkeep, creating a viral sensation long before social media. I have no idea if this is true or not, guys. No idea. Raising a glass to these innovators, our non-alcoholic Monster Mule is crafted with a spicy and sweet ginger mule kick and a zesty lime finish. We stirred in our Monster Energy Blend to get you moving. So share one with a friend, take a pic and tag Monster Mule on Instagram to continue the tradition, unleash the beast. So that's really, really cool. You know, they're really going out there. You know, they're bringing up the history of the alcoholic drink and they're saying this is our own twist on it. I do not know how this drink is going to fare in the UK, guys. Like ginger beer is a ginger ale. It's a, you know, it's a very specialised thing. Um, I really don't know how this is going to go, but it might be a bit different. It might not be just as sweet as it was the American version. The American version had like 600 calories or something. This seems to have... Thirty calories? Seven calories? Okay, now I have to try this. Let's see. This is, this is going to be completely different. It's also very fizzy. Oh my goodness. So let's see. Oh, okay. my goodness. You get such a strong gingery smell here, guys. It's absolutely crazy. You know, it's so gingery. You get it. You know, it t smells like drinking old Jamaica. I know some old guys in my in my shop who come in as customers that buy, you know, the old Jamaica ginger ale. And they would love this drink. Um, You know, if they like energy drinks, it would give them such a kick. So there may be a market for this. But let's, um, I can already tell from the smell, it's so gingery. It's so overpowering that I'm not going to like it again. I gave it one out of five last time. Let, let's see how we go. It's just, I mean, don't get me wrong, like the ginger tastes so much more subtle than the last time that I had the, um, the last, the, the last time that I had the mule, like it's not overpowering. It doesn't kind of overtake you and it does have quite a crisp limey finish to it. Um, so I don't know if it's, if it's different in the UK or not now or, or what the crack is, but actually from my very first sort of like, um, my very first taste of it, it's not amazing, but it's not bad either. It's actually, um, actually don't mind it just as much. Um, I'll, I'll take another couple. I mean, it's the same thing again, guys, you know, like I said, I gave away the other one to my brother the last time. I'm probably not going to 
uh, you know, like, buy this again, but it's really not as, just as bad as I remember. It's, it's okay. I mean, the thing is, guys, if you have had ginger beer in your life, um, then you're probably going to know already if you're going to like it or not. You know, oh my goodness, though, it just sent, like, vibrations through my body so I must have got some sort of kick off of it there um good god if you like a Moscow mule and you like energy drinks then this is absolutely perfect for you already you know straight out of the block but I mean I don't mind it it's the zesty kick to the end of it's very nice um uh, sorry the, the zesty lime finish to the end of it's very nice um but overall you know it's just ginger's not for me um if it is for you I think you'll really enjoy this drink but it's you know, that, um, that that varies, so it does. But anyway, yeah, Mon Monster Mule, I'm going to give this one a bit better. I'm going to give it two out of five. I'm super excited. You know, I'll probably do a re-review re of Ultra Fiesta, which I loved. Until after work the other day, it um, exploded in my bag and absolutely covered all my stuff with, um, with, with Monster. And then I wasn't just as big a fan of it, but I probably will do a review of it soon. Um, I'll be I'll be doing a review of this chaos or papillion or something like that as soon as it, it comes out. But um, yeah, for now you know I'm gonna give the mule two out of five. And listen, I, I, that, that that's all I've got to cover today, guys. I hope that you are all keeping okay. Um, you know I'm going to go see my boyfriend as soon as I've put, uploaded this video. Um, so I've got a nice couple of days ahead of me. Um, really hard last week for me. Um, been it's been very depressing and very sad and very um, just kind of hard, you know. And nothing's gone well. A couple of things have gone wrong, but it's just in general. I think as somebody who does suffer from depression, you know, I have my high days, I have my low days. Um, but yeah, hopefully I'll have a nice week with my boyfriend, who is apt shout out to uh, my boyfriend Soren, who is absolutely amazing. Um, I am. Uh, very happy. I will see you all again soon and take care of yourselves. Okay. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you again.